Across the country, the cost of renting an apartment is skyrocketing, and downtown Chicago is no exception. There are several reasons for the new and very expensive trend. Yes, from millennials to the booming tech job industry, Chicago has its reasons for the high costs. Tisha Lewis live in the South Loop with more. Well, Don and Jeff, coming soon, signs are plastered on leasing developments across the city. You can see one behind me over my left shoulder, buildings under construction. This is one of many reasons why rent is going up with no reprieve in sight. That's the sound of success, attracting droves of young professionals to downtown Chicago and driving up the cost of rent. Commercial property tracker Reese Inc. says the average U.S. rent jumped 14 percent compared to five years ago. I definitely could have gotten a much cheaper apartment in basically any other area, um, but it was mostly convenience that made it worth it to me. College student Kelsey Quinn lives in the South Loop. I pay about 1300 a month, and then my roommate pays the other half of that. So you guys are paying 2600 Yeah. It's a lot, I know. And rents are on the rise by more than 3% this year alone. Buildings are competing with these new rental buildings, the luxury buildings. Um, they command rent prices of three to up to twelve, fifteen thousand dollars $15,000 a month. And therefore, their neighboring buildings can also drive their prices up. Real estate broker Sheila Dantzler says the demand to rent is booming, in part because of the economy. Nearly three million more people have jobs compared to a year ago, and millennials prefer to be close to work. You have a lot of tech companies moving in because they want to be where the younger people are. Groupon, Google, Motorola Mobility. Their workforce doesn't like to commute. They want to live downtown. And Dantzler says people are willing to pay for upgrades and convenience. Very high-end interior finishes, high-end appliances, high-end amenities. It's like living in a hotel almost. Developers reportedly built nearly a quarter million apartments last year. That is up about 14% nationwide. Now, Don, there is a glimmer of hope. Real estate is cyclical, so living in the suburbs or buying a home will be back in style sooner than you know it. Back to you. <laughs> All right, thanks for that glimmer. <laughs> Thank you, Tisha Lewis, reporting live tonight.